Okay, we're here to uh, affirm a, the affirmation of love. The affirmation of love is a personal commitment between two souls. It is an affirmation of an important relationship between two human beings. The construction of their love and the trust into a single growing energy. It is a commitment that requires and deserves daily attention as well as a lifelong consecration of the ideal of loving kindness back with the will to make it last. I mean, true love gives nothing of it but itself and takes nothing from itself. Love does not possess, nor does it, does it can it be possessed. For love is sufficient unto love. Love has no desire but to fulfill itself. To awaken at dawn with a winged heart and give thanks for another day of living. To rest at noon and meditate love's ecstasy. To return home at eventide with gratitude. And then to sleep with a prayer for the beloved in your heart. And a song of praise in your lips. Okay, now please hold hands. And Rob, repeat after me. I commit my life to my partnership. I commit my life. I promise to comfort you. I promise to comfort you. To encourage you in all walks of life. To encourage you in all walks of life. I promise to express my thoughts and emotions to you. I promise to express my thoughts and emotions to you. And to listen in times of joy, in times of sorrow. To listen in times of sorrow. I love you and you are my closest friend. Now you say I will. I will. Right. Now Lisa, repeat after me. I commit my life to our partnership. I commit my life to our partnership. I promise to comfort you. To encourage you in all walks of life. I promise to express my thoughts and emotions to you. I promise to express my thoughts and emotions to you. And to listen to you in times of joy and times of sorrow. And to listen to you in times of joy and times of sorrow. I love you and you are my closest friend. I love you and you are my closest friend. I will. I will. Alright. Now, uh, what token of devotion will you offer your beloved? May these rings symbolize, be a symbol of the affectionate community. These two lives are now joined in one unbroken circle. Where you go, where they go, may they always return to one another and to their forgiven togetherness. May these two find each other the love for which they have yearned. May they grow in understanding and compassion. May the home which they establish together be such a place of sanctuary that many will find home or friend there. Um, may these rings on your on their fingers symbolize the touch of the spirit of love in their heart. And Rob, I'm going to just take the first. Place this finger, ring on Lisa's finger and repeat after me. I give this ring as a pledge of my love. Give this ring as a pledge of my love and as a symbol of our unity. And this is a symbol of our unity. Okay. I give this ring as a pledge of my love and a symbol of our unity. Okay. As much in Bob, Robin. Lisa have affirmed their love together before this company, have declared their unity by each other giving and receiving a ring, and have now joined in mutual esteem and devotion. I, as an ordained minister, proclaim this affirmation of love. Now you feel no ring, for each of you will shelter the other. Now you will feel no cold, for each of you will be the warmth of the other. 
Now there will be no loneliness for you. Now there is no more loneliness. Now you are two bodies, but there is only one life before you. Go now to that dwelling place to enter into the days of your togetherness. And may your days be good and long upon the earth. You may kiss the bride. <laughs> <laughs> if you ever fall in love, fall in love with someone who wants to know your favorite color and just how you like your coffee. Fall in love with someone who loves the way you laugh and would do absolutely anything to hear it. Fall in love with someone who puts their head on your chest just to hear your heartbeat. Fall in love with someone who kisses you in public and is proud to show you off to anyone they know. Fall in love with someone who makes you question, why were you ever so afraid to fall in love in the first place? Fall in love with someone who would never want to hurt you. Fall in love with someone who falls in love with your flaws and thinks you're perfect just the way you are. Fall in love with someone who thinks you're the only one they would love to make to wake up to. Oh, yeah. 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 Oh, yeah